those who have visited Dunham Massey Hall in the past, you're all aware of the hall and the magnificent outbuildings. But are you aware of the buildings that lie derelict, hidden away in the woods? Whilst Dunham Massey Hall was built in the early 17th century, the Deer Park itself existed from early medieval times. The building is often referred to as the Slaughterhouse, but this is actually a myth built up over time. Constructed in around 1740, it was originally built as a gamekeeper larder rather than a slaughterhouse for use by the Earl's gamekeepers. Venison was an important item on the Earl's menu and essential for the kitchen cooks to prepare sumptuous meat for the table. The deer were actually killed out in the park and their carcasses brought back to this building for dressing and jointing. By the late 17th and the early 18th century, the Brick Act had come into force and bricks were made of a more standard size. The colour, the hue and the size of the bricks were all important in the construction of these buildings. Now the brickwork used in this building was generally of a very high standard, mainly in Flemish bond, although head bond had been used and popular in the early 18th century. Whilst working for the Lord of the Manor may today seem to us to be a glorious job, I'm sure the hours were very long and I'm sure the pay was very poor. In the 18th century there would have been open louvre panels in the upper floor where carcasses could be hoisted up to hang in fresh circulating air. Whilst the summer months would have brought warm idyllic weather for the gamekeepers, there's no doubt in winter it is a totally different story. It was during Victorian times that the building became redundant as a new game larder had already been constructed much closer to the hall itself. Now I find it amazing that a building over 300 years old has survived the ravages of time with Mother Nature battering her year in and year out. In the coming months I'll be exploring more hidden buildings such as this one here, but why not come down to Dunham Massey and take a look for yourself? My name's James Baum and you've been watching TV Presenter for History. <laughs>